Hello, gentlemen. Patrick Ryan here, founder of Wingman for You. We help men find the women of their dreams by teaching them how to approach women with confidence. And today's video is simply about how do we capture, how do we capture their emotional side of a woman so that she always just wants to be with you. Well, let me ask a question, guys. Do you have a hard time connecting with women? Well, if you do, I can tell you, you're not alone because most men have a hard time connecting with women. And that includes me, believe me. Married almost four years now, and sometimes we just disconnect. Well, on the website, idiva.com, they released an article that specifically said what women want. And oh my gosh, it's like the keys to the kingdom, right? What do women want? Two things that women want in a relationship. One is they want an emotional connection. Okay. Hmm. That could be a tough one, huh, guys? Number two, they want men to be sensitive to their needs. Okay, let's think about this. They want some rough and tumble guy. They want a guy who's confident, who knows what he wants, knows how to get it, yet they, we need to be sensitive and emotionally available at the same time? Wow, no wonder 50% or more relationships fail. Anyway, let's figure out how we can do that. Let me see, how can we be emotionally connected? Well, probably the biggest thing we can do, guys, is that when a woman has an issue, when she has a concern, we should just listen. What we tend to do is we tend to repair it. We get our tool bags out, we get the skill saw out, we get the level, we get the wrenches, the screwdrivers, and there's no fix in it. She doesn't believe she's fixable. In fact, she doesn't want to be fixed. She just wants to be understood. Hmm. That's a good one. Understood. Okay. So emotionally, she just wants us to support her and be available when she needs us? Hmm. Sounds like we need to just be friends with her. How do you have a romantic relationship with your best friend? Well, I've been told that oftentimes your best friend's the best person to have a romantic relationship with. I haven't had that luxury personally. However, when we look at emotionally connection, I think what they're saying, I'm just guessing here, perhaps this will help you with the relationship you're in right now, but I'm just guessing what they really want is for us to be in tune with how sensitive they are with certain things, like work. They got a boss who's maybe a bitch who's just not treating him well. And really what they want is for us to listen to them and not try to correct it, not try to help them, not try to bail them out, not try to protect them, but just listen and perhaps empathize. I'm sorry, honey, I wish I could help. I wish there was something I could do. Or we should just ask, what would you like me to do? How can I support you? Those sound like emotionally connected questions, yes? Perhaps they are. So sensitive to their needs. Man, that's a tough one. I think the challenge here, is, guys, is that, yeah, we can be sensitive, but we just don't know what they need, right? <sighs> hmm. When she's angry, when she's had a bad day, she probably doesn't want us to approach her sexually. Okay, that's sensitive to her needs. When um, when she gets in a best uh, when she gets in a fight with her best friend, hmm, maybe she just wants us to again either be supportive or just be understanding that I'm sorry you got in a fight with your best friend. She doesn't want to have sex. She's not interested in jumping in the bed when she's angry at somebody else. Well, one of the best things we can do is keep her at bay and not be angry with us. So I was just thinking about this because after reading that article, I re recognized that maybe I'm not being as sensitive as I could be with my wife. And emotionally connected, I believe that they're, they're looking for us to actually be a little vulnerable and let them know what we really want. And perhaps if we do that, 
they'll let us know what they want. Anyway, I hope this has been some help to you. If you're in a relationship right now and this has been some help, well, go ahead and like this video. There's a lot of other men out there could probably use some help. And the more likes I get on there, the more the algorithms will send this out to other people. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. There's some great free content on there that may just help you save a relationship or find the woman of your dreams. Thanks for tuning in. I will see you on the next video.